What's up YouTube, Tech King Mike, and I'm back with another video for you guys. Today we are going to be going over the Pataka Caseless Thin Mag Easy Case 4 4 Samsung Galaxy S24 Ultra. That is really clever how they did that. Mag Easy Case 4 4 4 4. All right. Going over the packaging, of course, we always have to go over the packaging. Let me zoom this out just a little bit. All right, going over the packaging for this case, obviously eco-friendly material that is the new wave now so as you guys can hear it's very paper like you know nothing too fancy or whatever magsafe compatible right down there at the bottom made with aramid fiber as you can see this is the sunset edition i am going to get the blue one because i think that that looks amazing and i feel like it would look really freaking good on the purple uh, on the violet s24 ultra but as you can see that's a little bit of a highlight of what it's going to look like as far as the texture is concerned take a look at the back of the box we have caseless thin Tactile and anti-slip, MagSafe compatible, airy light. So obviously, airbed fiber, fusion, weaving technology. You guys can pause this and read it all for yourself if you want to. So let's go ahead and pop this open and see what we get on the inside. Now, this is the Sunset Moonrise, okay? Now, the light might be a little bit too bright for you guys to read this, but be light, be lively, okay? And that's just a nice little thing that they have in there for you guys. Pull this out. And as you can see, there's not really too much else going on. Get ready, the game is about to begin. Okay, let's just go ahead and peel out all these inserts and everything. We don't really care about too much of that, so let's just you know go ahead and toss that off to the side. Now, taking a look around the case, as opposed to another one of the cases that we just covered on the channel, that would be the Banks case. This looks completely different. Just a few of the differences between the two of them. As you can see, the Banks, they do both have a top cover but the size is where it's different. The Banks has that full coverage on the side in addition to the part where the button cutouts are. The Banks has full coverage. The Pataka is more of like a back cover with very, very minimal coverage. Very minimal coverage along the bottom or along the sides. So let's go ahead and pop it in. Camera first as always. And let's see what we got going on. So of course, this color actually looks really good with that violet. It kind of blends right on in and it does have a really good texture to it. I don't know. You guys might not be able to hear that too well, but it does have a really nice texture as opposed to this one where it's just very smooth. And I only have the Banks out for the comparison, of course. If you want to know anything else about the Banks, make sure you go catch that video. It's on the channel. But as you can see, we have the cutout for the camera, all the individual rings. I did say that in the Banks video. This is what I would have preferred. I really think if we could have gotten a combination of like this texture with like say the full coverage of like the Enzo and the like just the overall feel and grip as far as like how it grips the phone on the banks man that's like the perfect airman fiber case and if you guys have any other cases as far as like carbon fiber that you want me to check out let me know down below i know there's the later case i believe there's another company out there thinborn so definitely let me know if you guys want to see any more airman fiber cases covered on the channel but let's take a look around and as you can see Pretty much open sides. Let me see if I can get that to focus in there. It's pretty much open sides. Okay, not really too much going on over there. Same thing on this side, just open. I don't really care for that. Personally, I'm not a fan of that. I, I wish that they would be covered like the banks or like the Enzo cases are, but what can you do, you know? It is what it is. That's just the way that Pataka likes it. Now, this case does have MagSafe, okay? And as you can see, you can get to your buttons and cutouts very easily. No reason why you can't with a case like this. I mean, they're wide open on the side here. They do come up a little close to the buttons, so possibly would have preferred. I mean, if they can do it like that, what well, will stop them there from just adding a little bit more of like a little cutout over them, you know? I think that might have made it look really nice. But overall, the Pataka case is nice. I personally do not think that they are, that it is worth the money that Pataka charges, but at the same time, there are some people out there who really and truly like thin, minimal style cases. This case is cheaper or is more expensive than this case, which is more expensive than this case. So in order of like, you know, the most expensive to the least expensive, you have the Pataka Banks and then you have the Spigen. Let me get that off the Spigen because that just looks really bad. You can tell I just finished eating a nice piece of chicken down there. So, I mean, when it comes to Airmid Fiber, these are the three that I have. And out of the three so far with the Pataka, this, 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 this one is really nice as far as the texture is concerned. I can see how people would really like it. But one thing about the Pataka that I do not like is that because the case 
right? Because the case doesn't really have anything on the sides as far as like, you know, gripping the phone, it's very easy to pop that off. You see, you guys can see I'm, I'm not really putting very, very much effort into that at all. And it is just very easy to pop that off. And that concerns me. That makes me wonder like, you know, how good is it going to be in my pocket, you know, or, or anything like that. So personally, it's okay. It's okay. It's not a bad case, but you know, for the money, I'm not really sure if it's one that I would lean into like that. But you guys let me know down below in the comments. What do you think about the Pataka Mag Easy 4 4? The Samsung Galaxy S24 Ultra. If you guys are feeling this case, let me know. Uh, there will be links in the description if you want to pick one up for yourself. I encourage you. Try it out. You never know. It might be your cup of tea. Like I said, it's not necessarily mine, but it's a good case. It'll definitely stick around and it'll definitely be in the rotation. But in the meantime, I'm going to go ahead and let you guys go. I'll catch you all in the next video. It's your man Tech King Mike. Peace.